Hey, I want to ask you a question. Have you heard about the latest homeopathic medicine? I mean, this is a medicine that will bring healing to most people. I'm not saying it's the cure-all, end-all, but it is a great homeopathic medicine. Hi, I'm Paul Fredericks, pastor, and this is Pause on Purpose. Today, we're talking about joy, and today's Pause on Purpose verse tells us about this great medicine. Proverbs, the author was Solomon, who wrote these. It was kind of like a journal uh, mentoring book to his son about life and, and how to gain wisdom. That's the goal. When we look at life and maturity, the goal is to gain wisdom. No matter what our calling is, no matter what our vocation is, it's to glean wisdom in the midst of the trials that we're going through so that we will function like fully mature followers of Jesus Christ. Proverbs 17.22, our verse today on Pause on Purpose says, a joyful heart is good medicine. Boy, isn't that the truth? When you hear good news, when you understand that your illness isn't going to be lifelong or anything like that, or doesn't matter. But when you get good news and your heart's rejoicing, it gives healing to our bones, does it not? But it says, but a broken spirit dries up the bones. There's something about being broken that just makes us ache all over. Now, again, we're not minimizing chronic illnesses or severe life-limiting illnesses. That's not what we're doing here. What we're saying is God has the ability and strength and the power to put joy in our hearts, to revive not only our hearts and our spirits, but our bodies, and to allow us to experience great joy, joy that is not manufactured by happenstances, circumstances, or how the weather is going today or how the stock market is going, or whether or not, you know, you fill in the blank. Joyful heart comes, as we've discovered today, or, and all this week, joyful, a joyfulness comes from the Lord. And as we pursue God, he brings healing, not only to our souls, but he can bring healing to our bodies. And beloved, that's a medicine we can all take. You go with God because he goes with you.